Hey guys, it's Wit with NatureHills.com. Who doesn't like avocados? From making tangy guacamole to smooth avocado toast, avocados make a quick and nutritious snack. But they can be kind of tough on the budget, which makes the fact that you can grow them right in your backyard extremely appealing for most. The question isn't, should I grow an avocado tree? It's, which avocado tree should I grow? Before we get into it, it's worth mentioning that many avocado trees make lovely indoor potted plants for those of us who aren't lucky enough to live in the tropical climates of zones 9 through 11. Follow the same general rules for growing citrus indoors and you'll find yourself with a happy avocado tree year round. We have an incredible selection of avocado trees and I wanna tell you about them, so let's get started. Number five, Monroe Avocado Tree. This glossy dark green avocado stands out with its light green flowers that appear with star-shaped blooms throughout the spring. With its unique blossoms, it's sure to catch the eye, but we know that's not why you're growing these. The avocados tend to ripen later in the season, and this tree does great when it's planted outside in full sun or used as a large houseplant if you have a nearby sunny window. Number five, Monroe Avocado Tree. Growing zones nine through 11 or indoors four through 11, dense lush evergreen foliage and are great indoors. Number four, Hall Avocado Tree. You know that classic avocado shape? The one that kind of looks like a pear? The Hall Avocado does that. This special avocado has bright green skin and has a light green creamy color on the inside once it's ripe. Use it in your guacamole or various other summer salads. Hall will grow to be a pretty formidable tree outdoors, but can be kept compact with pruning to fit right into your kitchen during the winter. Number four, Hall Avocado Tree. Growing zones nine through 11, indoors four through 10, sun-loving, fantastic, broad-leaved evergreen, and makes a great privacy tree for those of you in the South. Number three, Donny Avocado Tree. Pollinators will flock to your yard for a chance to snack on the nectar from these trees. Donny is a really interesting variety because you'll want to plant a type A avocado with a type B avocado so that you'll have a larger crop of fruit. A type A avocado is when the flowers open female in the morning and change to male flowers in the afternoon. Other than that, Donny is a low maintenance tree that loves full sun. Number three, Donny Avocado Tree. Growing zones nine through 11, indoors four through 11, attracts pollinators, evergreen foliage, and sun loving. Number two, Bacon Avocado Tree. I mean, this avocado has just the best name. With its smooth green and easy to peel skin, you'll love these avocados for smoothies, salads, garnishes, and more. Plant this as a specimen tree in your front or backyard for a great harvest. Just wait until you see its glossy dark green leaves that give your yard a tropical forest vibe. These are self-fertile, but like other fruit trees, having both type A and type B plants nearby will produce larger crops. Number two, Bacon Avocado Tree. Growing zones nine through 11, four through 11 indoors, late season harvest and self-fertile. And number one, Haas Avocado Tree. Last, but definitely not least, we picked Haas Avocado to be our number one choice. It's hard not to when something like 80% of all avocados grown worldwide are Haas. With its beautiful dark green skin, oval fruit, and glossy foliage, it's sure to look picture perfect planted in your front yard or a pot in a sunny window indoors. Haas has durable fruit that's prized for its shelf life and flavor. When planting, remember to give your tree about four inches of mulch and keep an eye out for overwatering. Number one, Haas Avocado Tree. Growing zones outdoors, nine through 11, or on the patio and indoors, four through 11. Full sun and the world's most popular avocado tree. Did you know that the flowers on an avocado are unique because they are neither male or female, but open up as one in the morning and revert to the other the next day or that afternoon? If that feels confusing, don't worry. All you need to know is whether you have a type A or a type B and simply pair accordingly. All that information can be found on our product pages or on our hashtag ProPlant Tips blog. As always, if you like our content, please leave a like and subscribe to our channel. For more plant info and inspiration, check out our Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, and Twitter. And until next time, happy planting.